reporters, welcome back to my channel. As you are well aware, teen mom to Starlia Messer ended her engagement of just a couple of months with Jalen Mobley. And the two have been a little bit weird about it since it happened. So first of all, they understandably went straight to wiping out all traces of each other on their Instagram accounts. Um, and then they went on to release a joint statement on the breakup, the ending of their engagement on Instagram, but they quickly deleted that as well, which led us to believe that uh, something really kind of like shady happened behind the scenes to get them so upset with each other that they would even delete something claiming that they had a mutual love and respect for each other going forward or that they would work on a friendship moving forward, but I digress. Um, then articles started coming out claiming that Jalen had been cheating on Leah at some point in their relationship. She discovered it and that is why she decided to end the engagement. Well, now most recently after those rumors came out, Leah Messer took to Twitter uh, to, listen, I barely even know what she's trying to say here, okay, but I digress, uh, to, 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 to fight back seemingly about those rumors of Jalen cheating on her or whatever rumors are circulating about the end of their very rapid fire engagement. So on Twitter, she tweeted the following, while y'all are tripping on what the reason for the breakup is, we're solid, refocusing and transitioning into better days ahead of us. See, this is something that like is very common in the teen mom world with people like Farah, with people like Jalen, with people like Leah, with pretty much everybody. Like sometimes they'll say a bunch of stuff and again, it's like, listen, I speak English. I know what these words are, but together they don't mean anything. You know what I mean? While y'all are tripping on what the reason for the breakup is, we're solid. What does that mean? These are all English words, but what do they mean when they're put together? What I'm getting here is that Leah is trying to be very condescending and urban, but condescending above all about the fact that people are curious about why her highly publicized relationship came to such a screeching halt so quickly. Um, but then she says, we're solid. What do you mean we're solid? To me, we're solid means that our relationship is solid, our union is solid, and it is something that is, you know, something that's a deux for two people. You know what I mean? Like to me, I see it as a unit. Um, so I didn't really, you know, to me it's kind of like, well, are you back together with this man? And now you're kind of like trolling us. Like, what does it mean? And then she says that they're refocusing and retransitioning. So we're solid. Is it because we're refocusing, meaning we're re-putting on that ring? We're transitioning back into fiance hood. I don't know, into better days ahead of us, right? Like, I don't know. Like, it kind of seems, it just, it seems like a lot of nothing, but like she might be hinting at a reconciliation with Jalen, I'm not sure. The whole thing is just a little bit odd, but I will say though that I really don't like the whole while y'all are tripping on the reason for the breakup. It's like, kind of like, oh, while well, you little peons are over there stressing out, wondering about this relationship, like we are moving on or we're good or whatever. It's like, sis, don't come at, like, uh, at us like that. Who says it like this? Is it Nicki Minaj? Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't. Because nobody asked to see all the freaking photo shoots that you guys put out, right? Especially that one of Jalen with his little belt, okay? His little Lane Bryant blazer. Nobody asked to see these things, but you guys put that stuff out. In fact, I begged you to stop. My eyes begged you to stop. But they put this stuff out on a near weekly basis, if not weekly basis. And all of a sudden it's like, why are you guys like so concerned? You know, it just, it doesn't make any sense. I really don't like it. I don't like the condescending nature. And I just feel like the forced trip in, like put into it is just so cringe to me as well. Um, they're refocusing and transitioning into better days. Again, this is like the whole empty words thing. I, I wouldn't really classify it as a word salad, but I definitely would classify it as a bunch of words strung along together that mean nothing together, right? Like I just, I don't know, like the whole tweet was just lame. Um, but I feel like if you kind of read between the lines, she might be hinting that she might go back, get that old thing back, you know? I'm not sure, but at the end of the day, whatever she decides to do, I hope that this was a lesson to her to stop moving so damn quickly in relationships. You are not a single, young, tender rony Leah. You are um, a mom of three young girls, and unfortunately, these three young girls have lived with all, uh, and, and it's, 
astonishing amount of random men at this point in their lives and it's just not fair it's not healthy and it's not safe and I hope that you finally learned your lesson and that you're gonna move a little bit slower you're gonna move with regard for their safety not just like their physical safety but their emotional safety as well you know this is not cute this is not the time to uh to play around on urban dictionary trying to find something cute to put out on twitter this is a time to reevaluate your life and the ways in which you are constantly putting your daughters in danger but i digress anyway you guys let me know what do you think about leah's tweet did it mean something to you are you reading between the lines the same way i'm reading between the lines let me know what you think in the comment section down below and as usual we'll chat that's all for now thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time